YouTubers, today I thought I would do a review on a new mascara I recently picked up. It is the Maybelline New York XXL Pro Intense 24 Hour. And it has two steps, and I really like this mascara. I put it on today about 10.30, and right now it is almost 7 o'clock, so I've been wearing it pretty much all day. I really am happy with this product, as you can see. It just, it really, I think, looks really nice. It's held, it's held its curl. It's just really nice, really good mascara. So the first coat, the wand looks like this. And the, it just seems to really volumize and add the look of extra lashes. So that's the first step brush. I also like, I don't know if you can hear it, but... Do you hear that little click? It's It kind of really ensures that you get a really solid seal on the mascara. And I like that because it's, you know, it'll probably last longer. It won't dry out as fast. They really close very tightly with a click. And this is the second one. It's kind of it's a little curved. I don't know what I'm doing. It's a little curved. It's pretty thick and chunky. This really adds volume. And really thickens your lashes. Now this will not curl your lashes if you do not have naturally curled eyelashes. This is not going to curl your lashes. This is more of a volume and lash enhancer. This will not curl your lashes so I definitely recommend, I always just curl my lashes. I use the e.l.f. Um, I cannot talk. I use the e.l.f. Um, eyelash curler for a dollar. I just used that before and then I curl, and then I apply the mascara and it really holds, it does hold the curl but it will not curl your lashes. So you know as you can, if you can see if it's picking up on camera, it's just a very nice, um, you know, it holds the curl. It's a really nice deep black. Just really pretty. Um, Gosh, I don't remember how much this was. I'm guessing around eight to ten dollars. But it's just, I think this is a really good mascara. This is in very black. I'm, I think that's the only color they have. But it's just a really good two-step mascara. I think it really adds volume and a little bit of length, and just makes your lashes look a lot more fuller than they are. But again, this will not curl your lashes, so don't expect this to curl your lashes. Don't go out and buy this and say it didn't curl my lashes, and it's your fault. It really won't curl your lashes, but it will hold the curl if you curl your lashes before. It will maintain your curl. It won't droop down. As I said, I've been wearing this since about 10 o'clock this morning, and it's now 7 o'clock. I don't have any flaking, not like any whatsoever under my eyes. It was very messy, though. Um, like when I put it on, I actually ended up having to redo all my eye makeup because it got um, all over like where my eyeliner is, it got on my lid, it got a little bit on my lower lashes, so it's very, I guess it's very wet and it doesn't dry very quickly. So I definitely suggest just when you put this on, do not look up, do not blink your eyes a lot. If you look up, you're going to end up getting a lot, you know, on your eye makeup. I just recommend just kind of looking down a little bit and just doing that for maybe 20-30 seconds just so it can dry really well. But it's also two coats, you know, so it's, it's two different steps, so it's several coats of mascara, so it'll take a little bit longer to dry. But all in all, I would definitely buy this. This is something that I would definitely buy. I'd probably give it an 8 out of 10, only an 8 because, like I said, it is very wet, but I really, really like this. I think this might be one of my new favorites. Um, it's just, it's really good. I like how it makes my eyelashes look. I like that it makes them more fuller and a little bit more lengthened. So I would definitely give this an 8 out of 10. I would definitely recommend buying this. And Maybelline a lot of times has a buy one get one half off. So you know if you want to you can wait for the sale or a lot of times there's coupons and newspapers and stuff. So I think it's a pretty good deal for a really good mascara. So I would totally recommend this. So let me know what you guys think and I'll talk to you later. Bye!